What's up everybody, F Brock One hitting you with another video. The last time I got on this track and the weather was as good as it is right now, I made my new personal best. Today, if I can't break 11s, I don't think I can, man. I need a new driver. My tune is solid, the weather is good, my car is good, tires are good, conditions are good on the track. There's no reason why I shouldn't break it. Right now I got my car cooling down I want it to be as, I want it to be ready, man. I'm not gonna move this thing. Uh, I if, if you're watching this after I went live on IG, you know that I'm putting in the work, man. I, I, and you know, I don't, I don't cry over spilled milk. If people don't wanna support me, if people have their favorites, uh, if people think that, you know, I'm bought, not built, um, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. I just know that the Mako Project, this is my last hurrah right here. If I can't get it, I'm moving on. Uh, I'm just gonna make the, continue to make the car look good. But as far as trying to get any records, I hate to say it, man, but I'm just over it already. Uh, I, I don't like giving up on things, but you know, if you've been with me since the beginning, you know I only just started racing in January on a track. So it takes time. I had a lot of races, but I still need improvement. I have to give a shout out before I even get out on the track to RZG Motorsports for helping me put this thing together. Uh, I, I, I just couldn't have done it by myself, especially Dylan. He has been very instrumental in making it happen. And of course, everybody knows that, you know, Derek Robinson has been putting in major work to get my tune in order. And uh, I think the tune is solid. I think the build is solid. It's time. And uh, hopefully when we get done with this video, I got good news for you. Help rock one out, y'all. All right, everybody. So y'all know that I came out here around maybe 6.30, 7 o'clock. I have not made one single run. I've been letting my car cool down. I want the motor to cool down. I want the transmission to cool down. I want everything to be perfect for me. So when I put it on the track, this first hit. If I, sorry about that. If I do what D-Rob told me to do, I'm pretty sure tonight is my night. I just want to show you who's lined up. It's a good lineup, man. Good lineup of street cars out here. They also have the uh, 252 list crew, which is like the professional drivers out here running. We got a lot of street cars. A lot of street cars. Excuse me, man. We got a Z out here. Let's see what we going to do. that I raced last time. Back out here again. You gonna put it back on the track, man? All right. Yeah, so we got, we got some fast cars out here. Don't sleep on them. So we're starting to move up in the line. So I'm going to go ahead and get in line. I'm going to walk y'all through what I'm going to do. I forgot my mount today. So I'm going to be doing some old crazy rigging up stuff. I have some electrical tape that I put on my... <laughs> I rigged this up. Hopefully it'll work. If it doesn't work, I'll turn back every I'll turn everything back on once I get my ticket, but I'm struggling, man. Everything just threw me off too. With that IG blocking me from going live. It sucks. I wanted to share this run with everybody. I'm still gonna give it to you, but unfortunately it's gonna have to be possibly after the run is over. Alright, so while I am getting ready I'm gonna tell y'all what I'm gonna do 
All right, so last track day, I came out here. You know, I was wondering why I was screwing up. And I sent my data logs off to, to Derek so he can, you know, see if there was a boost issue uh, from the launch. After reviewing the, the data logs, he seen that I was getting into boost a little bit too late. So I was leaving the line in vacuum, which was not only taking some tenths of seconds off my time, but it lowered my overall trap speed. I ran 122 mile per hour trap speed at the very highest of my run. A little bit after the finish line, I hit 122. I hit 120 by the um, tracks timer at the finish line. I'm thinking I had 122 at the finish line. Either way, that was my fastest time I ever recorded. And hopefully tonight, I'm gonna break this record and I'm gonna break a new trap speed record. So we'll see. All right, everybody, I'm about to go up to the line. I got my contraction, I got my traction control all the way off. I got my sprint booster on. Sport mode six. I'm running. Uh, wait till I get up here. I'll let you know what I'm running. I think I'm running like E38 or E37. Let's see. You want pro tree, right? No, no, regular tree. Regular tree. Yeah, right. regular tree. Yeah, so I'm raising in regular mile. tree. Quarter mile. Quarter mile. And uh, we'll see what happens, man. I feel good. Let me put my seatbelt on before I forget. All right, so tonight. Run an E38, E37-ish. Uh, you can see what the IATs are. It's like 74 degrees right now. I'm not gonna do a burnout. I'm just gonna go around the pit because that seems like it works best. All right, I'm moving up, y'all. I'll get back with you in a minute. See you at your finish line. All right, y'all. I don't know what the f happened, but that fucking race was a shit, man. Hopefully, somebody out here recorded. Uh, I don't know if he got me or not, because it was very close, man. We'll see when I get this ticket. But I promise you, I promise you, man, if I didn't hit 11s on that run, brother, damn, man, I had a perfect tree. Good run. I don't know what else I could do, man. I don't know. That was a very good ass run. So we'll see. Adrenaline is pumping, baby. I know for a fact. If I didn't get 11, I'm damn near close. Holy shit, that was a good run. What I run, man. What you been out to, man? What, uh, like, can you tell me? Oh, shit. Can you tell me what I ran? Because I don't want people to think I lied. Yeah, hell, we got 1195. Well, you on the eighth? No, no, no. Quarter mile. All right. Quarter mile, 1195. Woo! Thank you, baby. Y'all have a good one, man. All right. So, y'all heard it, man. I finally broke that 12. I didn't get the 11.5 that I want, but I got down, got the 11.9. I warm my tires up. I'm gonna hit it one more time. I think I can get it. All right, y'all. I'm excited as I did not get my 11.5. I ain't gonna lie to you. But let's look at this damn uh, ticket. Woo! Yes, sir. I got one more in me, man. 
look at that. And I know for a fact I can do better because, yeah, I didn't max out my my uh, trap speed. So I'm gonna hit it again, man. I'm gonna let my car chill for a minute and I'm going back at it. All right, y'all, so I'm lined up for my second run. Uh, as usual, every time I, I'm pumped up and ready to go for my next run, an accident happens or something happens. So I'm just waiting for the track to get clear. This will be my second run, and I'm taking my behind home after this. Got a good little crowd out here. So that scamp that I raced that blew me out during the cash days, he just did a run, solo run, and crashed. So I hope he's all right. You know, he has a very powerful car. So, you know, I hope this man is all right. And uh, hopefully we can get back started soon and without any injuries or anything like that. So. Second run, y'all. Second run. I'm doing a solo run. it was 1197 so I'm legit an 11 second car man and I hit 120 I knew I hit 120 my 60 foot man I thought it was better than that 